more of that gold is doing a review today on a handbag that kind of resemble fish scales. Yes, I am. It also looks out of this world, so I will use the robot voice. And yes, I did. It's very difficult to describe this, but in a good way. The one I will be reviewing is the Aurora Luminous Shoppers handbag found on takealot.com. To be honest, I thought it would be bigger. It is big enough, but I thought it would be bigger. It is so beautiful, I did not really need to say a word because the visual images of this handbag is just so satisfying. Keep watching until you get to the flashy footage. You will not be disappointed. Hello, I'm Moore, a goldfish breeder by hobby. My other videos will prove that this one is a bit out of niche, but I just had to. There is something fishy about this bag, and I love it. I waited well over a year for these bags prices to drop. I mean, when it's not a new thing anymore it is supposed to get cheaper, right? Wrong. Instead of dropping, their prices went up. Thank you Joss from Holland for sponsoring this video. I will post the link to Joss's channel below in the description. And thank you Take A Lot for delivering it 6 days early. It cost 1100 South African Rand on Take A Lot. That is $57, 44 British pounds, 48 euros or 5000 yen. These bags come in different designs and brands. On the outside, they're all the same to me. I often order from Take A Lot and they are reliable. Not one package ever went missing. No, this video is not sponsored by Take A Lot yet, unfortunately. Hint, hint, hashtag Take A Lot. A bag comes with a protective zipper bag. If you use different bags and store it. It would have been nice if it was packaged in a branded box. I would have liked to see it packaged in a nice glossy product box. Mind the shadows. I unboxed it in bright sunlight to wow us all. There it is and, Mamma Mia, it is beautiful. Mamma Mia. Just look at how the colors are changing. This is not everyone's style or liking, but to me it is... Ah! like rubbery panels without making the bag too rigid all straps are also hollow flective or however you would describe it wait what hollow flective did i just make a new word hollow flective Ooh. the quality feels good to the touch it is mostly dark and many shades of gray depending on the light i couldn't resist I just had to play with the shades of grey words. We want more than 50 shades. I love that it is not any colour, it is every 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 colour. This zipper feels like good quality. It has bigger teeth and is metal, not plastic. How many bags have you thrown away because the zipper broke? A hook for my keys. Cool. Three pockets inside of which one is the standard zip pocket. Nicely silk lined, like most decent bags should be. I saw the Luminesque brand has a purple lining. Let's get cheeky with it. How it's made. If you don't care, just enjoy the visuals. It is made of tiny glass beads and microspheres on the surface. The retro reflection is greatly influenced by glass bead diameter and the number of microspheres on its surface.
such reflective materials with high refractive index glass beads or prism lattices the core material determines the range of reflective light along opposite direction of light returned. Wait, what? Rewind. <laughs> Reach reflective materials with high refractive index glass beads or prism lattices the core material determines the range of reflective light along opposite direction of light returned. Okay. A history of reflective materials. Reflective materials have two core components. Glass beads and micro prisms. Glass beads are uniquely developed glass or ceramic with hundreds of microns per millimeter with hollow, solid and porous glass beads. Glass microspheres consist of borous silicate. A microprism is two transparent bodies of non-parallel planes. I know, I know, you already knew that. Its main function is to reflect light in different directions. On this back it really does. I'm pretty sure with the correct lighting you can see this about a kilometer away at night. This gets divided into a waterproof layer, a bead layer, a viscose layer and a wax paper layer. It is beautiful and satisfying to look at. Look, 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 look here, look! Woo! This is not everyone's taste. If you are a hollow mania like I am, you will probably love it too. I think it is worth the price. I will not regret this purchase. If you like this.
I hope you enjoyed watching this as much as I did making it. Hit like if you liked and subscribe if you want to see what I come up with next.